We have a furniture 3D model in our viewport that uh, we are going to use it for uh, wireframe renders. And I'm going to explain it to you step by step how to create uh, three, four, five methods for wireframe renders. What we do, we add a camera here and we go to the camera. After we go to the camera, we go to the viewport overlays and we click the wireframe here. After we click the wireframe, we go to the view here and we press viewport rendering image. And uh, here we have the uh, view, uh, wireframe render. But if we want to have the background transparent and uh, we need to make a few changes here on the viewport overlay, we just click uh, the floor and the axis. Also, we go to the film and to the background, we make it transparent. Now, if we create a render, the background is transparent. Uh, now, our render is on the solid, less solid wood. If we want to create a render only seeing the edges, the wires, we need to go to the rendering mode. After we go to the rendering mode, we go again to the viewport rendering image and now we have only the uh, wires. And we save it as a PNG and with Photoshop we can make changes. Also we can uh, create the wireframe render in uh, previewing the materials like view and we have it here. Also, if we want to create the render while seeing the render mode here, uh, this is not possible. For example, it shows only the wires, but uh, if we go to the Photoshop, we have the wires. Also, we have created the render here and we just place it above. We just place it above and we have the uh, rendering uh, plus the wireframes. Also, if we want, for example, to make even more like uh, we are in solid view and we just want to change, for example, how the material looks of the solid, we can change it here and anything we want. If you like this tutorial, give it a thumbs up. If uh, you have any suggestion about the next tutorial, leave a comment. Uh, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.